Okay, we're gonna extract the stud out of the head here. It's broken off. I have some Craftsman drill out extractors. This stud here is actually an M10, but we're gonna use an M8 because the M10s is a little too big. And I don't wanna drill through the threads of the uh, head. Because you don't wanna drill too big because you don't wanna drill through the threads of the head. You just wanna get the stud out. You don't wanna damage the head. So what you gotta do is you gotta install your extractor into your drill. Put your drill in reverse. And uh, this little part right here actually slides back a little bit away from the drill bit because the drill bit's on the end there. First thing you want to do is punch a hole right in the center of the stud there. If you don't have a punch, you can use a Phillips head screwdriver. Put it right in the center and hit it with a hammer. Now I'll get and start trying to drill. You definitely want to make sure it's in the center because you don't want to mess up your threads in there. So if it doesn't start drilling in the center, go back and punch the hole better. Drill slowly. After you get your hole drilled down enough, take your extractor out and you want to get the threaded part all the way down to the drill bit so it can start extracting the bolt out as you go down. And when I get down so far, then I'll stop. Get it installed back in the drill. And you want to keep going slow with it. You don't want to burn your bit up. You want to make sure you're drilling in the stud and not through the head. Drill at a slow speed setting. Because when it gets to this point right here, it's going to lock onto the stud. It's going to try and reverse it out. Here's not want to come out. Since we couldn't get our stud out, we're gonna use a smaller extractor. We're using an M6 now. And we're gonna drill in the center of the hole that we were drilling before. Again, you wanna go very slow with it. You wanna put pressure down on it. Like I said before, you'll drill down enough to get your drill bit down enough and then you'll pull it out and you'll turn the extractor down so it will extract the bolt. But the main thing right now is make sure you're drilling straight so you don't drill into the threads. You don't want to mess up the threads on your head or else you have to re-tap it. We're going to take our extractor and turn it down to the drill bit and it should go down far enough to where it will start extracting the bolt out. If it does start extracting it out, I would stop with the drill and I would hand turn the drill to turn the stud out because it could possibly pull the extractor out with the drill. As you can see it's drilling down. The extractor will eventually get to the point where it grabs the stud. That's good. Our extractor broke off in the drill, but it's actually still in the stud, so we're going to try and turn it by hand. Just go very slow with it. You don't want to break loose that extractor, or we'll not get it back in.
as you can see the stud is coming out with it and it's out